Okay, four, 405. Thursday afternoon, I think it's the uh, 9th of May. After much preparation, driving around in circles, calibration, I think I finally have things ready to seed here. I'm uh, going a little bit lighter on the wheat this year. Set it back to about 81 pounds per acre. Fertilizer, I'm going right around the 85 pounds mark. So that's, for future reference, that's uh, M27 for the seed. No, M29. M27 for fertilizer. I don't think I've left any doors open. Oh, I nearly forgot this. Now this would be really fun. I did this once before years ago. I removed that chain off the seed sprocket when I'm just calibrating the fertilizer one so the seed one doesn't run while I'm calibrating. And once I'm done calibrating, the plan is to put that chain back on the sprocket, but uh, if you get forgetful, as some people do, you'll go and seed about 50 acres uh, with uh, the sprocket turning. And in canola, that's, that's some serious problems. Anyway, we'll get that set right here. Right then, lids are shut, sprockets on the chains, or vice versa. Always kind of nice to start out right close to the yard in case there's any minor problems or details that need sorting out. At least I'll be right close to the workshop and tools. So, pull into this field here that I unhydrous last Saturday and uh, unfold my wings. with the narrow spoon type openers for starters anyway mainly because there's uh, pretty much zero weed growth out here to kill so the sweeps would be a little bit overkill and uh, hopefully the uh, whoops, the narrow openers will not disturb as much soil and therefore not waste any moisture because we certainly don't have any to waste here it's supposed to rain tomorrow. Actually, it was supposed to shower today, but uh, as you see, blue sky. Anyway, fire up the fan, turn on monitor, clean the dust off so I can read it. 3070. Hmm. It's a little low. I think I should be cranking out about 3400 RPM on that fan. This is supposed to adjust the flow here, but I guess the cable is seized up, so I have to get out and uh, use a half inch wrench to adjust it under the cab. So, also have to set up the uh, monitor here for counting acres. Since the counter on the cedar doesn't work, I've been using this for several years and it's pretty accurate. We got to set our equipment width, which in this case is 30, or it was 30.2, but this machine is 28, so, uh, whoop, too much. Uh, we'll call it 27.7 to allow for a little overlap. So, we should be good to go. 34.50 on the fan. on the seed and fertilizer. 
I see wheat and I see fertilizer. I guess we're good. Unless I've missed something. Ah, not a good place to carry your water bottle. Other than that, we're good. I mentioned it was pretty dry here. At times I can hardly tell the air tank is back there, let alone that the shafts are turning. Just have to hope the monitor's working. Looks like I'm getting some diesel fuel delivered. And I've got a hose popped out of its opener.